So, 122 has just dropped right now is uh, for PC servers and Xbox in half an hour of this recording. Uh, right now for me it is half past 12 midday and well Daisy just dropped it for PC half an hour ago and now we've got all the sexy update news. So from here we have the added section and that'll be the sling bag, the army pouch, canvas bag, leather duffel bag, hip pack, craftable dry sack bag, new animation for sound and activated heat pack, what act variation of the fingerless wool gloves and a DLC section in the main menu. I believe that will replace the Livonia uh, tab when you load in. Now we've got a range of fixed things here from a server crash for it to vehicle deletion, car horns, we're not played when this outside other players network bubble and all of this stuff. Now if I scroll down you'll see how much there is and what I'll do is I'll just you know just scroll through it slowly for you guys so you can see it but for me <laughs> I think this is too much for me just to read myself so just to pick out a few things we've got roll flares will continue to burn up to a minute even after reaching ruined state destroy our fuel pumps will still yield gasoline crossbow bolts did not reflect the damage states correctly medieval helmets were consistent impact sounds when thrown crossbows didn't have the sounds when using prone didn't have sounds when dry shooting indoors. The record of ATOG 648 was blurry on low graphic settings. Jumping while applying gag bag, uh, gag and bugs of rag, and all this stuff here. Now, when it comes to changed, there's not much. It's uh, a nice steady amount in my books. So, balance gear armor values against melee weapons. Balance damage caused by bad melee weapons and infected. Blunt melee weapons now inflicted significantly more shock damage and health damage sharp melee weapons and now inflict significantly more health damage than shock just that that one the chance of suffering bleeding now both depends on weapon infected type as well as protective clothing so that's good so if you have a plate carrying helmets it will do it deal with less damage certain low tier sharp weapons will no longer cause pushback even when using heavy attack chance of suffering bleeding is now based on weapons and armor PBO data is now verified before entering the login queue. That's massive. It'll prevent you from uh, getting into a game, sitting in a queue, just for it to, you know, not work. Uh, reduce weight of gas, and ca uh, gas canisters. Improvise a fire geometry for several firearms. Improvise the fire geometry of several weapon attachments. Improve sound of explosives. I loved the new sounds of explosives, and improving it even more will make it so much better. Reduce the damage taken by belts and torso hits by 20%. Reduce the surface noise when diving over specific surfaces. Item widgets are no longer visible when binded by a flash grenade or burlap sack. Updated the game credits. So that obviously will have the new uh, dev team as well. Being game server browser now displays in players exact player numbers. Massive. Absolutely massive. Instead of showing medium, it'll now show, let's say, 32 if you're in the 5th slot server. Move the column for slots in the server browser. Made the reception place in hospitals accessible. Infected can spawn with head torches again. Which is good because head torches were a massive thing, especially if you're playing official. Now, Central Economy has now had a change. Uh, for example, reduce the amount of backpack spawning. So that would be to uh, counter the new backpacks so it's now a stable amount and not overbird. Rebalance spawn location of backpacks, reduce the amount of tools that work as high tier weapons and increase their low tier counterparts. Gasoline canisters now spawn full with gasoline. Gas canisters now lo uh, no longer spawn with full gas. Power generator no longer spawns with full fuel. So uh, this will either be um, a random type of how much it will give but also it may be the fact that it just spawns with none in general. Now for the Chitonovus and Livonia editions, we had the winning billboards and billboard Z competition. That was huge because I saw many of those. I even submitted one myself. And uh, unfortunately I didn't win it. But the one that did win, the few that did win, was amazing. So we'll definitely keep an eye out that one. As well as the travel agency billboards. Livonia, it was a police event close to Bennett was misplaced. So they fixed that. Now to the server, a lot of these are to do with PC, as you can see with the PC at the end. Um, 
but all of these are fixing uh, login times, PBO errors, as well as CFGs and uh, you know melee problems and login and mounting and mounting of barbed wire defenses and stuff. So all that is fixed when the servers. Especially this one here, all energy based items with potential energy quantity, gas canisters, power generator, both flares, can now have an energy value set through types.xml. So, um, this is just in general, but this is something that will, you can increase, decrease the amount of things that will spawn within it. So, the both flares can spawn at half health or half, and they can be adjusted to full. So all of these are launched uh, based, so when you load into Daisy on PC, but I'll, I'll just leave that there so you can check it out. So, so yeah, if you have pause it, you can read that. Now, there's a lot for modding. Um, I will scroll through slowly. Uh, well, you know, I could just put it there. Now, uh, once I noticed when I was uh, reading through it myself was this one here. Now the abstract way of set Doppler to enable disable Doppler effect and this goes for the one which you can inc uh, turn it on and off so that can play when you're uh, on the radio. We've got one here button dot widget to get text out strings to set a non-localized text. Uh, random bool dot function script caller equals and script call is valid methods humans can change stance parameter new stance as raise rate hands flag now having code so that i believe that you, either you don't do the animation or do the animation uh, for that one uh, daisy play implement is already falling command to blip failing command from starting but these are all just modding so if you're a modder i would definitely check these out and one last known issue is for this one here and that is pressing the r key so I just tab out this one. Uh Pressing the R key after emptying the magazine can result in a weapon desync. A fixed is undergoing internal testing. If you don't know what internal testing is, they're trying to, uh, they're currently working on methods to fix it and they've probably found one and they are working to see if it has been fixed. Uh, that would be updated in the next patch, which could come in a few days if they have fixed it. But yep, yeah, all of these are cool little additions they've included and I will definitely if I do have the pictures, I will definitely put these on during edit so you guys can see it on screen as we go through it all. So, that's everything there for you. Obviously, if you go on Daisy's PC, all of that is there for you. This is PC Stable 1 to 2 update 1. Um, I would assume it's pretty much the same for Xbox. Um, we got minus all of this here, all this launcher stuff. Uh, well, some of the modern. Yeah. But apart from that, thank you very much for watching. And I'll see you soon.